guys, welcome back to Tower of Fantasy and we are following still the story quest. Let's see what's over here. Oh, some, some robot arms. Is this the Hamlin? Yes, the guy we are seeking. That's right. Oh, sorry. Not exactly the talkative type. Mr. Kim told me what you've got planned. I don't mind the extra help, but you'd better be as strong as he said. I just hope you don't get in my way. How about you fill me in on the current situation first? Where is the Hyena Queen? That madwoman is probably resting in the camp. I don't know the situation on the inside. There are guards patrolling every inch of that place. What's the plan? The question is that. I'm going to continue debugging the mission equipment. Why do you think they call me the Iron Shell? Brutes like you try to solve problems with your fists, but I'm different. I use the power of science and technology. For this mission, I've assembled the destroyer mecha. It still needs some debugging and upgrading. It should be ready in a few days. I can wait that long. Huh? You mean, you want me to rush in there now? I'm telling you, there's no way we can do it. I'm getting paid to do a job, not to throw my life away. I won't make a move unless I'm fully prepared. Or, perhaps you're willing to take the risk and drive this mecha into the camp yourself. I can provide you with technical support. How about that? Sure, I can do that. Huh? You're confident, I'll give you that, but it takes a lot of energy to start up this destroyer. Go and find some for me. There are lots of these things around here. Take this cybernetic arm. It'll help you to deal with the small fry, but be careful not to alert that madwoman on the inside. All right, let's go to work. Okay, first collect energy. I made special adjustments to this. It's going to feel great when you use it. Hmm, interesting. The energy should be in this area. Don't let her see you and come back as soon as possible. Nice. Cybernetic arm. Okay, I have... 10 minutes to do this. Okay. From the energy canister. Try to dodge some of those guys. Where's the canister? Going on, where is it? Is this it? Five percent. Okay. There's a big one. Okay, that didn't work quite as, as I wanted it. Okay, let's collect the energy. Big one. How much is this? Fifteen. Now thirty five. Collect this one. Right here is the next energy canisters. Okay. Don't see her. Don't know where she is. They get alerted.
Okay. Okay, got the energy. Okay, they didn't die. Okay, 75. I need one big one. Bigger this one. Come on, come on. 90. Five over there. Okay, I don't need to fight them. I think we have enough energy so you can come back now. Don't get tangled up with those guys. Okay, Okay, what now? Ah, oh, back so soon. Looks like things went well on your end. The destroyer is ready too. We just need to charge it and it'll be good to go. But before you leave, I want to make a deal with you. What kind of deal? I heard from Kim that you came for the Astrum. It just so happens that I've always wanted to see real Astrum up close. So, after you get your hands on it, can you let me take a look at it first? You got a deal. Haha, <laughs> great! I'll recharge the mecha now. You can help me to start up the energy device. Okay, if he only wants to take a look, it's fine. I'm getting ready to power the destroyer. Get on when you're ready and I'll send you to the Hyena Queen. I hope you survive. No problem for me. I will just finish her off. Oh. Oh. So I can't do a dash. I try to dash and shoot those rockets. Can I jump? No. Where? There she is. The recycling station. I think I triggered her. Yeah, there she is.
Oh no, she has a shield. Okay, the shield is down. Let's burst her down. Oh no. She defeated her. Interesting. But the destroyer is overheating and I need to take it back. You can take care of the peons on your own, right? Turn off the energy shield and come back with Astrum. Okay, that wasn't too difficult. Okay, the shield. All right then. But now. Oh no, I'm getting attacked. Oh. It took damage from this. Okay. Let's see, that's the Astrum, right? Yes. Okay, let's go back and let him take a look at it. Hopefully he doesn't backstep me in any kind. Anyway, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Hamlin, Hamlin, Hamlin. Haha! The lone hero triumphs. I can settle my commission with Mr. Kim. Uh, as per our agreement, I'll hang on to the Astrum for safekeeping. I'll return it once I've had a good look at it. Safekeeping. I, I thought you weren't just a look. Don't worry. I'm not the most popular guy you'll ever meet, but if I'm anything, it's trustworthy. I'll stay here for a while. Come back and find me later on. Hmm, okay then. Count's Hayes. Mr. Franz has come to the mines to investigate Hayes' activities. It seems either Mr. Kim or Geeks made a secret pact with the Hayes. Obviously we couldn't trust them. The Franz is also now involved. the way up. There he is. Franz, you're finally here. Mr. Franz, have you brought us any new information? Nothing good. You must have heard about the recent illness spreading through the mines. Yes. Have you found out anything relating to this matter? Not really. Mr. Kim said it was some kind of new unknown disease. His people are developing treatment, but he also admitted the medicines he brought won't work much. I think he might be hiding something from me, but I couldn't figure out what it was. I'll check for other clues. You keep an eye on Giggs, and let me know if any news broke. I sent the medicine from Mr. Kim back to Hycros for testing, and found something unexpected. What? This medicine seemed to contain only common chemical compounds. But Dr. Henry also extracted a small amount of inactivated virus from some samples. Obviously, Franz's voice doesn't work all the time. The gene segments of these viruses have been artificially modified to contain a certain genetic sequence. Okay. Once a patient takes it, the virus will infect the normal cells in their body 
and integrate the unique sequence into the ho host genes. Okay, so they get mutated. In short, these medicines will alter the genes of the people taking them to a certain extent. Also, Dr. Henry analyzed some biological samples of the heirs of Ida and detected identical gene sequences, meaning these drugs are most likely related to the heirs of Ida. Heirs of Ida? Genetically modified? So, what is Mr. Kim trying to do? I'm not entirely sure that Kim has anything to do with this. Giggs was responsible for the research, development, and production of the drug. He seems to have made contact with the heirs of Ida behind Kim's back. I also found someone selling the same things in Banjis, and the source seems to be somewhere in the mining area. Giggs must have something to do with all this. We have to find out who this supplier is. I'm counting on you to investigate the local area. Be careful not to make contact with Mr. Kim's people, lest you tip off the traitor. Okay, I'll meet back up with you once I get a lead. Okay. Let's chat with this guy. You don't seem to quite know your way around here. You're new, aren't you? How can you tell? Well, I've lived here for decades. I can tell who's new and who's not. The eyes always give it away. You seem to have questions, young one. Well, do you know who from the mines make regular trips to Banjas? Chris probably takes the most trips to Banjas. That kid never stays still, even as a child. Rumor has it he'd steal poor ore to sell, but that's been unproven since no one's ever caught him. Recording. Chris, a prime suspect. But how do they know that he stole ore? Or how do they come to suspect him? Katie? Hello? Excuse me, do you know anyone who can take me to Banjis? Bangies? What business do you have in Bangies? Bangies, Banjis, how is it pronounced? I'm going to see a friend I haven't seen in a long time. Hmm. I hear Banjis is a pretty busy place. I really want to see it for myself, but Uncle Chris said it would take a long time to get there. Uncle Chris? Uncle Chris works here as a miner. But he often brings back some interesting things from Banjis for me. I like him a lot. But did he just change how she pronounces it? But he always says it's not safe on the road, and he can't take me with him. Maybe one day, when I grow up... Recording. Suspect. Chris. Anito? I heard you work for Hycros. Yes, can I help you? They have some white outfits. I know this might seem rude, but can you help the locals here? The disease is making all of our lives more miserable. We... we're already on it. But to prevent further spread, I need to look into local people's recent activities. Do you know of anyone who's been to Banjas lately? Banjas? How would I know? Talking business with outsiders is Mr. Kim's department. I just work the mines. Everyone wanted to come to the mine and make a fortune. Look at us now, broke and penniless. Hmm, okay. Is this Chris? Yes. Yeah, that's right, you. New here, right? Let me tell you, the mines haven't been kosher lately. Supposedly the digging made some local deity angry enough to deliver punishment. Deity? I got some talisman here to keep you safe. I'll even sell it to you cheap. Show me. This is a special rune made by Hycros and guaranteed to work. If you're still not sure, I got other stuff I can show you. See, this is the latest drug. Not only can it cure the disease, but it can also prevent it. Even the bigwigs in Banjas recommend this. Angus, maybe he's one. Is okay. This the same drug passed out to the miners recently? Correct. As far as I know, even Mr. Kim is running low, so might as well stock up. Why did you sell it in Banjas then? Well, I got to expand the business. Anyway, are you buying or not? 
I'm wondering why you would sell it in Banjus when nobody there has infected the disease. Who are you? Oh, hi, Mr. Kim. Mr. Kim? <laughs> oh, oh my god, she... She fell for it. Mr. Kim, what brings you here? What? Chris ran away. She fell for this... For this trick, oh my god. There was a wall. Oh, he disappeared. Oh, there he is again. Uh, oh. Let's catch him. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. We can talk this out. Tell me what's the deal with your drug. Okay, okay. I did sell it to Banjus, but I'm just the middleman. Who put you up to this? Is it Mr. Kim? I wouldn't dare. It's. Giggs! G Giggs got me to do it for 30% of all sales. Where did the drugs come from? Why would Giggs want you to sell them to Banjus? You'll have to ask him that yourself. That's all I know. Not that I dare ask more questions. I'm warning you, if you dare tell Giggs about this... I get it. I don't remember having this conversation at all. Okay then. What was that? Is this story mode or I'm out of story mode? Anyway, we have to go back to France. Let me get this black nucleus. And then I will end this episode. Right here. And we see you in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And bye.